The overall goal of the following experiment is to detect influenza A virus using a microfluidic chip. First, run the sample with lysis buffer through the SPE channel to lyse the virus and extract RNA. Load the RT-PCR reagent with extracted RNA and run the reverse transcription channel to convert viral RNA into cDNA. Next, run the mixture into the PCR channel in order to amplify the DNA. Results are obtained that show the size and concentration of the amplicon based on the fluorescence signal from capillary electrophoresis. The main advantage of this technology is it accepts the raw patient sample and it integrates nucleic acid extraction, purification, reverse transcription and amplification into a single chip. To create two plaques, distribute approximately 9 grams of ZNX pellets evenly in the center of a metal plate. Place on a 198 degrees Celsius heated press for 5 minutes. Then, apply pressure slowly to 2500 PSI for another 5 minutes. Now, position one plaque onto the epoxy mold. Preheat at 157 degrees Celsius for 10 minutes and apply pressure slowly to 1000 PSI for another 10 minutes. Next, Wearing thermal gloves, remove the plaque and mold from the hot press and then remove the plaque from the mold before it cools down.